Hey everyone, it's me, Alex, and welcome to a brand new video. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to factory reset an Apple Airport Express. In this video, I'm using the Apple Airport Express second generation. So a factory reset does what it are the words. A factory reset, let's just say it's not working properly with the internet connection, it's just, it, you have an internet cable, it just got stuck, or it's not working. Or let's just say you forgot your password to the airport utility app because you don't have to create a password when you set this up to access its settings. Let's say you create a network uh, or connect something like that. You need to have a password. Let's say you forgot that. So you, a factory reset will help you set this up or fix this. But of course, you're going to have to start all over. You're going to remove it from your app. We're going to start all over again. So all you need to do to get to do a factory reset is your Apple Airport Express, a paper clip and the power cable to the Apple Airport Express. In this video, I'm using another power cable because where we have our Apple Airport Express, it's all like organized in there and I don't want to remove all those cables or the cable, but it works the same if it's the same power adapter. So I'm doing this because it has not been working well lately and I tried it already once and it works. So I'm going to show you how to do this. So let me show you how to factory reset. Okay. So here I have what we're going to need. So we have our Apple Airport Express, our power cable, which of course yours would be the Apple power adapter and our paper clip. So I'm gonna, for the first step is I'm gonna do is plug in our power cable so you can have power to the Airport Express. So let me plug this in right here to power and then we just plug it in to the Airport Express like so. The light, as you can see, turns on and I'm gonna fast forward, I'm gonna let this power up and I'll let you know when it's ready. So there we go, as you can see, the light is flashing orange and when it's working right, it should be flashing, or not flashing at all, it should just be a solid green light. So it's not working. So let's say, so now to factory reset it, there's no setting in the app. So you just can't go to your Apple utility app and just click factory reset. There's no factory reset a a function on your app, Apple airport utility app or, uh, or like a button on here. You can't do nothing. There's only this little hole that lets you do a factory reset. So you can't push it of course, cause it's like pushed in. So this is why we need our paper clip. So what you want to do with the paper clip is just open it up like this. Just so you can get like the pokey kind. And then we're going to poke this in this circle right here for about like five seconds. And then when you hold it, I'm not doing an apple, you hold it one, two, three, four, five, and then it'll start flashing rapidly. So I'm gonna do it this way so you can see when the light starts flashing rapidly. So let me see if I can get this real quick. Okay, I have it and I'm gonna start. So as you can see, I'm pushing in. You heard that little click and it's gonna start flashing rapidly. There we go. Once it starts flashing rapidly, you can release the paper clip. It's gonna stop flashing. So technically it's rebooting again. So as you can see, it's gonna start rebooting again. So I'll fast forward and then the light will start flashing orange again. But this time now it's all reset it, so there's no data on it. So it's gonna start again and I'll fast forward when it's done. So there we go. As you can see, the Apple Airport Express is flashing again. So now to set this up, you don't go to the Apple Airport utility right away. What you want to do is go to, you wanna to go to Wi-Fi, and then when you go down, it's gonna say in the bottom, it might take a few seconds for it to pop up, but if you click on other and exit again, there it is, set up a, a, a new airport base station. So it's gonna be your Apple Express, blah, blah, blah. Of course, they're all gonna be different. So what you wanna do is set this up. So click on it, gathering information about my network. So it's just reading the network it's on, like what my phone is on right now. So it's gonna give you your on, like on Spectrum H300, it will be looking at that. And as you can see, it's preparing for setup. So it's, right now it's just gathering the data. It's joining the Wi-Fi network that just comes preloaded with the Airport Express. Let's just say Airport Express dash zero is looking for that base station. So it's looking for the base station now. So now what you're doing again is setting it up again like you would from the first time you got it. So you can see it's looking for the base station. So after a few seconds, you're gonna see that this screen shows up. It says create a new network or other options. Recommended is to create a new network. So let's just say for now, since I'm just gonna do right now this demo. So let's just say our network is Alex's Wi-Fi network. So I'm gonna create a password for this demonstration. Let me just do one really quick. But of course, again, this is just to demonstrate. So later, of course, you can edit these settings on or in the Apple Airport Utility app. It's gonna ask you if you wanna save your password. You can click on save. So that means when you open the Airport Utility app, automatically it's gonna, you don't know, it's not gonna ask you for your password. So I already saved that. As you can see, it's looking for a Wi-Fi network we just did on the base station. But as you can see right now, it's still gonna be flashing orange because I don't have it connected with the internet. Port. So as you can see, it's telling me, it's prompt me in the app right there. As you can see, it's looking for an internet cable to be plugged in because I don't have one. So I'm gonna click on next, of course, because I'm gonna set this up right now without internet. So I'm gonna click next, continue anyway. 
As you can see, it's just connecting to the network. It's just prompting me like a warning saying that if you connect, we're not gonna have any Wi-Fi because I don't have uh, the internet cable plugged in on the thing. So as you can see, it's joining the Wi-Fi network that I just created. So let's just say you made guest network 01, it will automatically connect to the guest network or another network you did. So I'll, ref I'll skip through this once it's done setting up. So as you can see, Wi-Fi network is made. So Alex's Wi-Fi network is now available and there's my Apple Airport Express and I click on done. And then as you can see, here is our next. So if I click on, as you can see, if I click on that right now, it just says, uh, it's gonna say connecting, but there's no internet. So that's it. That's pretty much it. If you later want to, as you can see, I'm connected to it, but as you can see, it's gonna say no internet. So now later, if you wanna fix it or make some changes to the internet, you can download again the uh, Apple Airport Utility app and use the settings, let's just say you wanna create the network or make another name to do that. So that's pretty much it. That's how to factory reset an Apple Airport Express. If you have any other questions, please let me know in the comment section below and I'll try my best to answer that. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time in my next video.